Hey guys, I'm going to quickly go over the main differences between the Echo Dot 5th generation and 4th generation. There are some advantages to getting the 5th generation, but starting off, looking at the exterior, they're essentially the exact same. Now, perhaps one benefit of the 4th generation is if you look at the back, there is a headphone jack, whereas if you look at the 5th generation, it does not have a headphone jack. Perhaps not the most useful feature, especially since you can just hook up and use Bluetooth to connect through audio. But we can also see these power adapters are essentially the exact same. So then that leaves us with a few more things. So the Echo Dot 5th generation, it has improved audio experience for clearer vocal, deeper bass, and vibrant sound. The 5th generation also has an internal temperature sensor, which is nice. You can create routines with this to keep your home comfortable. And a third advantage of the 5th generation is it's going to add up to 1,000 square feet of Wi-Fi coverage and support for speeds up to 100 megabits per second to a compatible Eero network. So if you're using the Amazon Eero network to expand your wireless Wi-Fi signal in your house, then you'll be able to use the 5th generation Echo Dot to expand this Wi-Fi coverage. So there are some nice advantages going with the Echo Dot 5th generation, and especially if they're the same price, I would go with the 5th gen. Unless having that physical headphone jack is something that's important to you, but again, I don't think that's that crucial of a feature considering that you can just hook up audio with Bluetooth. And that's going to wrap this one up. So I hope this video is helpful walking you through the main differences between the Echo Dot 4th and 5th generations. I appreciate you guys stopping by. Consider subscribing to the YouTube channel, and I'll catch you back here next time.